day everybody welcome back to the dirty pat walsh channel on youtube with me your host dirty pat walsh happy new year's eve everybody i have a, a snuff review today for you um as promised uh so today we're gonna look at i have a couple i have a bunch of snuff reviews coming up but this one by far was the most uh, interesting in the in the lot to me just because i'm crazy about american like dry scotch snuffs um dry sweet snuffs whatever like stuff like railroad mills and two bros and uh checkerberry stuff like that but uh never heard of strawberry before i've i've had a european uh wilson's the Cheryl strawberry which is very different than what's in in the in this guy. Um, I'm not even gonna compare them, but you know, this one has like kind of a light mentholation, I think, and it's very dark in color, um, as you can see. It's kind of a coarse, fine to coarse grind on this stuff. Now, the stuff we're reviewing. Now, this is my snuff spoon. <laughs> for dipping dry snuff. I don't know. I think it's like a fucking David's Tea thing. It says somewhere. Doesn't matter anyway. Whatever the fuck. It's a, it's some weird teaspoon that's all bent. And I thought I thought it was neat. That's something I took home. It's brought with me from my old apartment. So... We're gonna, now, I, yeah, like, I usually dip this stuff, um, as of late, um, uh, American, I'm very congested right now, uh, I, I always have a lot of congestion problems, you know, um, which is why I like mentholated nasal snuff a lot, but, uh, American snuff is never mentholated to my, to my experience, and it's it makes for great dipping. So we're gonna take the, the little snuff spoon and get a little bit. You don't need a whole spoonful, mind you. It's like you can always add more. There you go. So we just Kind of hard to get it position. All right, and that's about as good as it gets. So, what do we got here? Well, it tastes like um, a very mild sweet snuff. Um, there's a bit of strawberry in there. Um, you know, if I was given this to try and say, guess the fruit. Um or guess what it's flavored with or scented with or whatever. I don't know if I'd know off off rip. Um, but it is it is quite sweet for a for a dry a dry American snuff. Um, mm hmm. I like it a lot. Um, you know. Dipping, dipping this kind of snuff, it's it's so good because like you need so little of it. These cans last forever. Um, somebody's coming into my house. Hello. 
You forget something? Oh, no, I just, I'm just coming back between two. Oh, things. you just put your laundry in the laundry. Yeah. Okay, I get it. I get it. Roommate moment here. Just having a little uh, laundry talk. <laughs> Letting our dirty laundry uh, out. Um, but yeah, I don't know. It's 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 really good. I you know even though I don't know if I would recognize the strawberry in it, um, it's it's pretty damn tasty for a for a dry scotch snuff or sweet snuff. I don't know. I don't ever know if there's a, like it. I don't I don't know. I don't know people. There's not much on this can. The Swisher International Wheeling, West Virginia. The, the WWW, uh, my eyes, I can't read this shit, but I'm sure it says swisher.com. Um, net weight 1.15 OZ as is standard for a package like this. Um, that big old flashy barcode there. So yeah, I like this can a lot. It's really old school. And, uh, it's, it's a, it's a cool can to have them, you know, have in my collection so so yeah it's 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 a good it's a good way to go if you like dipping dry stuff um it's a really good way to go if you like something sweet rather than uh, rather than uh musty <laughs> you know what i mean um so yeah i'd say go for it if you find it and you're into that kind of shit Pick it up. Try it out. It's only a couple bucks. It's, I don't know. I'm assuming it's it's probably like less than ten dollars. So but anyhow, that's uh that's that's the dip review for the day. Or the snuff review for the day. I hope you all enjoyed it. I hope you all enjoyed uh I hope you're all having a great day. Is what I'm trying to say. It's New Year's Eve, so uh, be safe and uh, have a great New Year's Eve, everybody. I might make some other little videos to post up today, but uh, this is the this is the the vlog I meant to do today. So thanks to my new subscribers. Thank you for all your support, everybody. I really appreciate it. And uh, be well, and I'll see you around the next time here on the mean streets of the Dirty Pat Walsh channel on YouTube. Here on Dirty Pat Walsh. Happy New Year's Eve, everyone.